Hi, this is Chris with EFS Training Science, and we're here today working on that EFS Overspeed Protocol, the EOP. Now, the way this works is basically what we're doing is we're taking the athlete and we're bringing them to approximately 10% above their natural top speed capability. In doing so, we're training their nervous system as well as their muscles to be able to handle and accommodate a very high level of running speed. Let's take a look and see how it goes. Okay, ready? Go loose. We're going to bring up this German made high speed treadmill to approximately 15 miles an hour. And then we're going to jump it up as soon as the athlete keeps on. He's going to be on the treadmill for approximately three to six seconds prior to extending all of their creatine levels. This will make certain that his running is efficient and effective. So the idea is we want to bring the athlete up to approximately 10% above their top speed and do so for no more than about 6 seconds. That way, they still are using creatine and ATP levels, they're not tapping into the carbohydrate energy system. The effect is tremendous. Matter of fact, this last weekend, this young man scored 6 goals in his soccer games, and some of them were based on breakaways. Again, this is an effective EFS overspeed protocol. See you next time.